let v be the real vector space of all polynomials in one variable with real coefficients and having degree at most 20 define the subspaces w1 by this set and w2 by this set then the dimension of intersection of these two subspaces is this type of problem asked in net type problem numerical answer type so we need to find dimension of intersection intersection of two subspaces is again a subspace so we can find dimension also this is finite dimension dimensional space w1 and w2 so intersection will be finite dimensional as v is a vector space is a vector space of all polynomials in one variable in one variable with a real coefficient it means field is real with real coefficients and having and having degree at most 20 what it means degree of a polynomial suppose this is c naught plus a1 x1 plus a2 x2 the higher degree will be x raised to the power 20 if a polynomial of this type of or a polynomial can be represented in this format then this polynomial should come in vector space v and the dimension of this vector space v is equal to a higher degree plus 1 so its dimension will be 21 so we need need to find dimension of intersection by the property of intersection if any element w1 if any element belongs to intersection then it will follow the property of w1 and w2 and what are w1 and w2 w1 and w2 is defined or given by this these two sets so we need to find its uh, dimension of intersection so let's suppose and what is the dimension what is the meaning of dimension of any set or any vector space any vector space it means if we choose an element any elements from vector space then at how many points then at how many points point points means at how many or how many constituents how many constituents of this vector space this elements are free to choose free to choose suppose this is a vector space oh, sorry element and uh, we are free here and free here and not here then its dimension is 2 because we are free at 2 place and there are 3 constituents of this vector so dimension is 2 dimension of this vector space V will be 2 so here intersection if any element belongs in intersection then it will follow the property of intersection and in intersection w1 and w2 
then dimension of w1 intersection w2 will be 21 because an an element belongs to w1 or w2 will have the dimension 21 if there is non restriction or linearly independent restriction so how many restriction are there p1 p1 is first restriction will be an element belonging to intersection p half p5 p7 p3 and p4 p1 p half p5 p7 p half p3 p4 and p7 1 2 3 4 5 6 so subtract 6 so dimension is equal to 15 you can find dimension by this formula dimension of intersection dimension of intersection will equal to dimension of w1 plus dimension of w2 minus dimension of sum w1 plus w2 using this formula you will calculate dimension of the sum of w1 plus w2 and here there is no need to find dimension of w1 w2 and uh, w1 and w2 dimension is easy to find but uh, some student can get confused in sum of these w1 and w2 so this is best way to find dimension of intersection so answer is 15